China has been strengthening and speeding up the training of pilots for carrier-borne fighter jets in recent years, as part of the country's efforts to holistically build its aircraft carrier system. Currently, the pilots for carrier-borne fighter jets in China are selected and cultivated among soldiers in active service and new recruits. The Chinese Navy started to select the pilot trainees directly from new recruits in 2020, gradually building a young and thriving team with excellent comprehensive abilities and a longer service life. Flying a carrier-borne fighter jet is highly demanding, just as the saying goes, the aircraft carrier deck is the most dangerous 4.5-acre piece of land in the world. Pilots needs to make a nose dive at the speed of 200 km per hour and land the jet precisely on a tiny area that is drifting with the tide on a runway of only 200 meters. To make a firm stop at the end of the runway, the pilot is required to hook the jet to the arresting cables on the carrier deck at the moment of landing. Nine years ago, on November 23, 2012, China's first aircraft carrier, the Liaoning, had its first successful fighter jet takeoff and landing. The successful flight landing also marked the debut of the J-15 as China's first-generation multi-purpose carrier-based fighter jet.